happy Dapper Day! Oh my goodness, this is so exciting. This is my very first Dapper Day at Disney World and I am so excited. I kind of last minute planned on doing this. I didn't I didn't really plan on going to Dapper Day and then I was like, I might as well. Like that's a huge Disney event and like I like Disney and I'm here and also I just happened to have the day off from work. So it's like Disney was telling me, hey, you should go to Dapper Day. So we're going to Dapper Day. I'm like half dressed right now. I have my shirt on, um, I just have Nike shorts on and then my hair is kind of done. It's like the base is done. I was gonna do something with it, but like I don't know what to do. It's 9.49. I'm heading over to my friend Rebecca's apartment because we're gonna finish getting ready together there. That's when I'm gonna fix my hair. Um, maybe I'll do like a red lip or something. Finish my makeup, finish putting my outfit on, um, and then we're gonna head to Magic Kingdom. I know a lot of people are there already, and so I really wanna get there like as fast as I can because I do have something in the afternoon that I have to get to, so I can't be at Dapper Day for too, too long, but I'm I'm still really excited. I'm gonna go, I'm gonna vlog, take some pictures, um, hopefully meet like a bunch of people because I know a lot of people go to Dapper Day. Just like, I guess you just go and you stare at people's outfits. I don't know what Dapper Day is, TBH, I've never been. If you're watching this and you're like, what the heck is Dapper Day? Basically, it's like, uh, a, a, an event at Disney World like unofficially but officially an event at Disney World where you just go and you dress up kind of like they would back in the olden days it's not like time era specific but a lot of people go like 20s 40s 60s and you like dress up and look really nice as if the way that they would dress up because back in the olden days you know they would dress up to go to Disney World and so it's kind of just like bringing that culture back from when Disney World first opened anyways and then what a lot of people do is they take their like really fancy outfit and they Disney bound and so they dress up like a character so their outfit is inspired by like a Disney character that they want to do and so my outfit is inspired by a Disney character I'm not gonna say it right now but if you can guess by the red shirt um uh, comment down below um but oh Disney World sign wow yay so oh, I'm really excited I've never been before so yeah let's uh let's go to Dapper Day <laughs> people are dressed up so that's fun um, I'll try to show like as many outfits as I can today it's just so cute everyone's so like vintagey and fun and cute this is so fun I feel like I look like a little schoolgirl with my glasses and my hair but that's okay anyway so we're in the Magic Kingdom now we're gonna go meet up with some people and take pictures and I don't really know what else you do but that's what we're gonna do yay like the talking flowers kind of thing. I made these pins of a rocking horse fly and a bread and butter fly. Oh my God. So it's very subtle. So cute. Yay. I just ran into her and she has the cutest outfits. This is her eighth Dapper Day. So she's a pro. Uh, I have a lot to learn. <laughs> so people are in this little nook right here. This is my favorite nook. And they're just coming and they're just taking pictures. This is the perfect nook because there's not a lot of people here. The sun is really good and there's a lot of really cute kind of like vintage picture spots here. So we took some pictures here and basically we're just going to go all around Magic Kingdom and take a bunch of pictures. Okay, so right now we're heading to the purple wall. However, there's like a million people here because everyone is here for Dapper Day and everyone is taking pictures. Just take a look. There he is, the man, the myth, the legend, my inspiration, my best friend. 
Look how cute. Oh my goodness, he's so cute. Pooh Bear. Pooh Bear was my inspiration for this outfit. That's why I have the red shirt and then the yellow skirt because Pooh is yellow. So that's my inspiration. Pooh Bear is one of my favorite characters and one of my very good friends. So I thought it would only be so I I thought it only makes sense to Disney Bound as Pooh Bear and that's what I did and I'm really happy with it because I very last minute got this outfit together. <laughs> and now we're gonna go take pictures around Hundred Acre Woods. So right now we're in the Winnie the Pooh store and they have the cutest little wall of Pooh Bear and they have a bunch of Pooh Bears. So that's what I did to take all my Instagram pictures that will probably be on my Instagram. I don't know, but um, this is where we took like most of our pictures. It's all Winnie the Pooh theme. Festival of Fantasy. I am so excited because I really want to see Doc like sprinting to Frontierland right now so I can get like a decent view. Honestly, we have what 10 15 minutes till it starts. I could probably get a front row seat. Uh, I'm gonna try. Um, but yeah, this is crazy. I just love seeing everyone's Dapper Day costumes. I just kind of like stare at everyone. Let's go watch Bosch. <laughs> Dapper Day content and I feel so bad currently driving home right now but I just kind of want to talk about Dapper Day with you guys and just kind of let you know what it was like what my first experience was like some uh, what I did really honestly all Dapper Day is it's where you dress up and you just go around Magic Kingdom some people they go and they just do it for the pictures and other people they go and they spend a park day but they're like in their super dressed up outfits so so many people a lot of people Disney bound some people go full out like petticoats umbrellas like freaking wigs like oh my goodness people go all out and I think that is so cool I don't think I'll ever be like that um I kind of liked what I did because it's really low-key I was not I mean it's gonna be hot outside but like people are in like full-on suits and petticoats and that's really hot so like bless their souls I'm happy with what I did a lot of people understood that it was like Winnie the Pooh it was enough to be dressed up and to be like a part of the experience but not like this is really fun we're on a curb <laughs> what i did today is i walked in and i went with my friends rebecca and noah um sometimes i can be really bad about showing people on camera just because there sometimes it might make them feel awkward and like it's just a lot easier when i just kind of do just me and you guys well, rebecca went as jane and noah just kind of dressed up super dapper they both looked so cute um, we met up with some other people um and we took some pictures and then we went around and took some pictures i honestly didn't take as many as i wanted to just because like we were kind of with a group of people that like I knew but I didn't want to like spend the whole time taking pictures of just me because that would be like a little selfish so I didn't get as many pictures as I wanted to but I definitely got a few good ones I hope I guess I don't know and I went to go watch move it shake it because I really wanted to see King Louie and then I ran into one of my friends and so then I went with him and he was meeting up with some Disneyland people so we went and hung out with them and then I met so it was like I just met a couple of my other friends all hung out at Columbia Harbor House and then after that I went back with my other friends Rebecca and Noah and we walked around we got some more pictures and then I met up with some other friends I watched the Muppets live action show for about five minutes and then we left um, and then what did we do and then we left and then I met up with another friend and then I met Olaf and Olivia today that was really fun she was really sweet I've been wanting to her for so long and I was honestly surprised she knew who I was like because I said hi and she wasn't like oh my gosh another fan like she knew exactly who I was so that was really cool I don't think she's watching this but like it was cool to meet you I met a lot of people I've been wanting to meet whether I talk to them through Instagram or I watch their vlogs or like whatever it is I met a lot of them and that's something I love about these like big Disney events is I just get to meet a lot of people that I've been meaning to meet and like I don't always have time to meet up with people and so when everyone is just in the same place it's so much easier to meet people so I met a lot of Instagrammers met a lot of youtubers just met a lot of people and that's honestly one of my favorite things and so that was really fun but if meeting people I'm meeting all of these new people and it's just really weird to have a vlog camera and like either vlog us meeting or put them on the vlog I don't know it just like I feel like that would make them a little bit uncomfortable and I know I don't want to meet someone and have to vlog it like that's not 
It's just like not a normal thing, you know what I mean? So that's why I didn't really get a lot of vlog content today because I was all I was doing was just meeting people and talking and mingling and I didn't want to have like a vlog camera in front of all of that and just kind of make it weird and like I don't know make people think I'm all about the vlog because I'm really not like I love vlogging and I love showing you guys my life But I like to separate my life and my vlog life uh, just because I think that's really really important So it's about four o'clock right now, and so I'm going home I'm gonna go get some Panera on my way home And I realized to get Panera I'm probably gonna have to walk in like this unless they have a drive-thru and I don't know if they do fun fact there's a Panera right by DCP Housing. If you can chat on the comments or Patterson, there's a Panera like right before you turn in. So fun fact. So I'm gonna go to Panera because that sounds like really good. I figured I would just end the vlog here because I'm not really doing anything else that's super dappery. But thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it. I will have more vlogs soon. More content is coming, working on an apartment tour, like all this stuff is coming, but your girl's a busy girl. I got a job, I got friends, I don't. If you went to Dapper Day, definitely comment down below whether you went to Disneyland or Disney World. Comment down below what you went as if you Disney bounded. And if you didn't go to Dapper Day, then comment down below what you would have Disney bounded as because I love to know. Okay, thanks guys for watching. Bye!